What's going on, guys, and welcome back to another episode of the final ARC series before ARC Survival Ascended. Last we left off, we we got this Baryonyx, and um, we also got two Dire Bears, a Shantung, and an RG. And can I access your inventory still? I still cannot access your... Hold on, can I hold E? No, I still can't access this guy's inventory. So, until something gets fixed, I'm just going to put you away. So, um, I added a couple more mods to the roster. It includes the Highland mod, which is right here. We got the Highland stuff and reusable stuff. I added reusable spears, reusable grapplings, reusable bolas, and reusable flares. And the reusable parachute. So in today's video, we're going to see if we can try to get one of those reusable... Okay, let's see. Can we make a... We can. Awesome. Oh, and those are my bears. I have them breeding in the background. Let's see. Um, We can get an extra crossbow. This one's for the grappling hook. But anyway, we've got some names for the... For the Raven, I was thinking Night Fury. I know he's not a dragon, but or she's not a dragon, but Night Fury, I believe, is just a great name for her. In today's video, I'm thinking about taming that 150 Carno. There is a max level Carno, and I'm thinking about taming it this episode. So in today's video, that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're going to Try and find that max level Carno. I do have five red arrows. So if we also find a T-Rex that's like high enough level, then we can try to see if we can tame that as well. And I do plan on adding more mods as time goes on. Like, I do plan on adding more creature mods. Because, you know, we're going all out with this series, so... I want there to be as much content as possible. Ostraptor. Now, I believe I have tamed one of these before. And I believe the way you tame them is by... The way you tame them, you just passively feed them. And basically, nothing will attack you. The only problem is they're relatively slow. So, we got this 130. Let's try and tame it. Okay, this guy's gonna take forever. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna come back to this guy. Apparently there is an unconscious Sukamimus and an unconscious Baryonyx somewhere. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. I put the tame tracker on it so I know where it is. Let's see if we can find that max level Karna. I think that's it right there. Hold on, let me get my stamina back. Because trust me, boy, we are going to need that stamina. Is that a shadow cat? 45. I should probably kill that shadow cat. You know, to make room for more shadow cats. Because I'm only going to tame a shadow cat if it's like a very high level. Like a max level or like a near max level. That's literally the only way I'll tame one. You are it, and you're about to die to vultures. Yep, it died. I hate vultures. There is another one over here. That's only a 55, though. Garbage. I'ma kill you now. Let's look at these lions. 85, 145. I could tame a 145 lion. But can I just pick you up? I can pick you up. Awesome. Alright, wait for it. Wait for it. Of course I'm starving. Wait for it. Now! There we go. And down he goes. Awesome. Um, there we go. We're going to tame a lion, and then I think we're going to go after that 
female. It only makes sense. That female, we might as well go after. And then we can have a mated pair and get an imprinted version. So I'll let you guys know when this lion is fully tamed. And there we have it. Lion tamed. This should give us enough time for that... for that Ostraptor. Okay. Shame we couldn't tame a Carno today because it died. But at least we're gonna get two lions anyway. Ooh, 145. Hmm. We also got a lion. I'm just gonna go ahead and take this lion out real quick. If I can grab him. There we go. Wow, Carnos are fast. Look at them like Usain Bolt. Carnos are fast. Wow. Well, these Carnos are anyway. Passive. Passive. Ah, he's probably lost taming effectiveness. Damn it, RG, why did you have to attack him? Now we're gonna have to kill him. Oh no, Micro Raptors! Okay, you can. What the hell? I hate Micro Raptors! Oh my god. Throw me off the saddle. Well, we'll see about that. Just fly away. They're not even worth it. That Carno's not even worth it. Damn, I hate Microraptors. Alright, are you the 130? You are the 130. Okay, come over here. There isn't any tall grass. Of course, you're a 145 Stego. I don't want to lead that lion towards the Stego. Now, of course, the lion's attacking the Stego. Oh my god, my luck. And the lion died. Great. Thank you, Stego. Thank you for ruining my tame. Alright. We could always tame this 140 Carno. Of course, there is a Microraptor. There's two Microraptors below there. Oh my god. There's also a couple of Raptors. Damn, there's a lot of aggressive stuff everywhere. Got a couple more lions. Microraptor, I hear you. You better not throw me off the saddle again. Alright, I want you all to come over here. All the raptors and all the lions come over here. No! I'm gonna fly high up so you can't get me. Screw you, Microraptor. Screw you. Where's your buddy? So I can do the same to him. Alright, you should be close to wanting something by now. So we're just gonna put in the other prime meat. And then you know what? The rest of our travels will be on the Ostraptor. Because this way here, Microraptors shouldn't attack us. Alright, where are you? There you are. They're also very good swimmers, so... Alright, let's see... There we have it! Ostraptor tamed! I do need a saddle to ride you. So we're gonna head back to base, get you a saddle, and then I guess we'll continue our journey to try and find a, um, a Carno. But first we'll test out our lion to see how it is, to see how it does. Because I'm pretty sure with the lion, you don't need a saddle to ride it. What's its stats? 29 points into health, which is not great. 29 points into melee, so it's not really that great. It's got a lot of stamina, 33 points into stamina. So yeah, it's not really that good. Alright, let's pull out our lion. And our Ostraptor. Pretty cool creatures. And let me put the Shantu saddle away. Let's check out our lion first. Not very fast, but then again, this is an imprinted. So, so we, we're expecting it to not be that fast. Okay. 
So let's see. What kind of damage do we do against this turtle? 152. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, about 152. That sounds about right. There we go. Let's kill this turtle real quick. This max level turtle. Well done. There we go. We got 20 levels. Let's throw a lot, all that into melee. All melee for this guy. Let's fight this Pelagorn and see how much we do. 274 now. Maybe a point into health. Alright, so this lion is actually pretty good, I guess. So this is from the Marnie's mod, in case you're wondering. So I'm gonna call you... Let's see. You can be Simba. I know, pretty generic, but Simba's his name. Okay. And let's check out our new Ostraptor. I mean, I said you were slow, but you're actually not that bad. Let's see the damage we do. 55. Oh yeah, we do a slash. I kind of forgot about that. We got a 20 and a 95. Kind of want to. I kind of don't want to attack a couple of trikes. Oh yeah, we got some hops as well. Now I believe with this guy we should be safe from all predators. 28 from the slash. I'm thinking 10,000 into. I think we should get another one and get an imprinted version. I'm gonna get up to maybe 2,000 health, put the rest in the melee. We should probably take the up. And the best part, we can shoot off the back of this guy, which is pretty amazing. So, Alright, let's head out, take the Argentavis with us, in case we find anything. Let's go on a little adventure. Now, as long as we're on the Ostraptor, nothing should attack us. I played around with it once before on, like, an off-camera survival series. Now we do 69 damage with the bike. Nice. We should definitely get another high level. We got a female. We need a male. So we can get a an imprinted version. Because an imprinted version will have that speed boost. Alright, let's see if we can find anything over here. Alright, we got... We got that. I think that's the level 15. Yeah, level 15. Stego. It's beautiful, though. Right, let's look around. And now, we can swim. Because we can swim pretty fast. This guy is really cool, actually. Let's continue searching through the jungle. Maybe if we come across a 130... That's a female. What are we? A female. We need a male. Okay, nothing should attack us. Not even this level 100 Therizino. Or this pack of raptors. We got a 140 male. That's a beautiful one too. But I'm pretty sure the one we have is also a male. So we're not going to bother taming that. I've got three arrows, red arrows left. Oh, hello, Spino. 95, eh, not the greatest. Oh, Spino's still attacking us. I think I found a T-Rex. Oh, I think I'm gonna die. Alright, just keep running. Just run. Spino's still attack us. We still gotta watch out for spinos. Alright. Let me see if I can heal up a bit. Yeah, that spino probably would have killed me, so maybe I should wait till I get an imprinted version before I deal with spinos. Because I'm pretty sure an imprinted version will be a lot stronger. 
I did see a T-Rex. So maybe if we swing by the other end, we might be able to catch a glimpse on what it is. Okay, that Spino is... Oh! Jump. Jump, 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 jump. He's still chasing me. He's still chasing me. I need to get out. Get out of here. Keep jumping. Keep jumping. Eventually, he's got to lose interest. Wait. Ooh, T-Rex. Okay, the T-Rex won't hurt me. Level 50. Yeah, T-Rexes won't hurt you. Ooh, a 130 Paleo Rex. We gotta tame that. Okay, let's get that guy. Okay, as long as we don't run into that Spino again, we should be okay. This is risky. This is very risky. Put the prime in your inventory. And then just... Uh, so what gender are you? Male. So we need a female. Alright, we're gonna be going home with a T-Rex. And then off camera, of course, I'll make some more arrows. And uh, get ready for like the next creature we try to tan. Okay, so note to self. T-Rexes, fine. Spinos, no go. The Spino will still attack us on sight. Good to know. So I'm sure if we gotta watch out for Spinos, I'm sure we also have to watch out for other semi-aquatic creatures. Like maybe Baryonyxes, or Capros, or Sarcos. We still gotta watch out for them, I'm guessing. Okay, so I will let you guys know when this guy is tamed up. There we have it. T-Rex has officially been tamed. Let me just go ahead and quickly grab this Aragosaurus. You won't attack me. Okay, good. Or else you would have aggroed by now. That T-Rex is about to die to a Therizino. Okay. There it is. There's the Spino. I'm going to come back with the T-Rex, and when I do, you are toast. Alright, I'll see you guys back at base. And we're officially back at base. We'll be using this guy from now on. Because we don't have to worry about stuff dismounting us. The RG can come back. The T-Rex we can put over here. Mm. Okay, let me get a Rex saddle, if I can. Tiger-striped T-Rex. Ooh, this is a beautiful-looking T-Rex. Let's see how much damage. 195, okay. I should probably check this guy's stats. You know what? I'll do that right now. Alright, let's see what we're looking at here. 38 points into health. Pretty good. 20 points in the melee, eh, not really too good. We might have to look for a female with very high melee at some point. So then when we get an imprinted version, we can easily, we can easily um, breed them up and get the best of both worlds. But look at this guy. I mean, look, that looks majestic. Majestic AF. Wow. I'd like to get up to 10,000 health and then the rest of the melee. There we go. Our strongest tame yet. Until we tame a Giga. Now we do 281 damage. Let's attack this unsuspecting trike. Yes, I do notice the Ichthyo Venatar in the background. Well, that's a 130 trike. Probably should have tamed that, but it's fine. Alright. More melee. Alright, I want everyone on passive for this. Oh yeah, we got 
20 points. Let's go. Let me get a good view of this. Look at that. I think I may have the perfect name for this guy. You can be Shere Khan. That's a Jungle Book reference because you've got the tiger stripes. You're like, like a tiger rex almost. That's awesome. That truly is an awesome creature. But yeah, with that, that is going to have to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. So long.